Hello YouTube, this is Tyans, and we are doing a second version of my Minecraft world. Sorry I have not been making videos for a while, i just been working on my house and try to make it better. Now, instead of just doing one house, I'm actually going to do two houses that I've made. So, I'll do the first one and then I'll go over to my other world and show you that one. Well, first off, as you can see, it's still the same area. Um, I just didn't do anything really with the outside but as you can see there's a big thing up right there now that is my mob spawner and my cactus farm is still there I don't really need all the cactus right now so for now I'm just letting it pile up and then just throwing it in some lava but it's still there I haven't gotten to a point where I want to show it yet but as you can see mob spawner it's built sort of with the cactus farm out so it's only that area that they can spawn in but still okay um, these tracks are what I'm gonna show you later but for now um, let's just go inside um, for this area I used to have a farm but I'm thinking of turning this into like a pool area where I could just I'm gonna block up all of that and take the dirt out and probably add some wool or some snow or just something else to just make it look better but it's still a working project work in progress and I haven't right quite done that yet and let's go inside now something you should notice is that I have two blocks of dirt usually what I'll do is I'll place these right here so when I am doing stuff in my house no mobs will have any possibility of coming in because sometimes they will spawn out where my old farm used to be now, as you can look in my house, it's pretty cramped up, but everything is just nice and close. Right here, I just have my chest for just dropping things off real quick. And these are what's... These are the same thing, I just have them in two chests because that was a fail. This is what I keep all my food in. And these are my cobblestone walls chests. I'm thinking of replacing all the fence with that, but I want to get a full chest first. And all these other chests are just other stuff that I just have in here. And this is where I put all my wood. I don't have a chest for it because it's not enough, so I just put it in this one. My two furnaces, an anvil, and a crafting table. Now right over here it says hiding room and progress. progress. So I'm going to show you that. I haven't really done anything with it, but what it basically was was a room just carved out right here and then I'll have like a chest for all my valuable things but then I decided not to do that because it got in the way of my other stuff and right here is where I keep my shovel swords and pickaxes and right here is where I collect my mobs um, usually what I'll do is I'll put my difficulty on hard or on normal and I will just let them pile up while I am downstairs or doing something else inside of my house so they'll just pile up right there you can see my cactus my old cobblestone generator I don't really use that I'm thinking of just digging that all out and just doing one of the vertical ones that just goes straight up and just having to leave my house and do that but I haven't really decided anything with that right here is where I put my cactus and my green cactus die there's still the water and here is my snow generator I need is a shovel and then I just keep digging in one of the corners and I'll get that as you can see um, there's still a part is digged out this was originally part of the farm but I decided to expand my house because I used to have just chests all right here so I just put them over there and I'm planning on replacing all the floor as well but I have not done that I put this half slab here because I found that sometimes I would be running and I'll go over it like that. But most of the time, um, that will not happen now that I have this. Right over here is my nether portal and my enchantment room. There's a block missing from there. Didn't put that away yet. Um, I don't really use this that much because um, cause, um, chanting is not really an important thing to me. I just pretty much just go with my tools. Right here is my storage room. I expanded it. And also over here, this originally was supposed to be my pool, but I just left it right here. I was digging to expand my storage room, and I just found this. Um, I dug out some materials over there. 
it looks like nothing can spawn in here but um, before there was like a little skeleton over here that was just messing around but yeah and I have a little picture frames above where most of my chests are these are just quick drop off stuff and I was um, and I'm planning on replacing all the floor with some wool as well since I got some sheep well got more sheep and this is my indoor farm as you can see there's carrots in the back there's some potatoes and wheat and all I have to do is just click this lever and just go right here now the thing about the way I built it is as soon as I go in here it will collect automatically but when I come out it will push me up the stairs well it will push me up this stair and then I can just go out and this is where I have all my planting stuff so that's like that and down there is my mine I don't really think you want to see it it's just a mine um, so now onward to the second part of my house now if you're wondering what that means then I'm going to show you now for my house I decided that I didn't want everything to be just right on top of each other so what I did was I built this track and just see what I did look at that look. you see the trails there's some enderman holes I hate those so much but here is what I mean get out of there here's my brick house just for this island I call this my nature island just because most of the things are on um, most of the things in here are like part of nature except for this like cobblestone wall thing there always seems to be some sort of pig I always get to here but usually what I'll do is I'll just come in here run around maybe breed them if I feel like it and then I'll just go out eggs don't really have a use for them yet but they're just there um, my sheep I only have four so far but that's really all I need for the wool I have this big tree which I did not want I don't know how to stop them from becoming big but um, I think you have to put a block over it but then sometimes that will affect how tall it grows even though I only want it a certain height I have this whole area out for different different reasons I was gonna have like maybe some sort of um, invention area to where I'll just put stuff that I do not have to add to my house and completely mess it up and as you can see there's two lines of trees what I'll usually do with these trees is I'll plant them in a row and then I'll bone mill them and then I'll just go down and collect all the wood that's usually what I do with those but um, now I just separate them just because right here I have my hose and axes um, my dirt sand woods I put my bone mill up here but I used it all um, I didn't use it all but I put most of it in my house um, Here's where I put all my seeds, my melons, my pumpkins, carrots, wheat, sugarcane seeds, tree seeds, apples, and down here will be nothing. And craft a bench and table in case it gets dark. And it seems to be getting dark. Okay, so let's go back to the house and I will show you part two of my Minecraft house. Because I, like in the be beginning of the video, I said I'll do two. So. And if you're wondering what that little beacon is over there, that's for, um, that's my secondary mining place. Um, so, that's just right there. And let's go to my second world. Whoops. I called it my Minecraft world just because I didn't feel like making it a different name. And here we are. Now, this world is pretty much just for exploring stuff right here I have my little tree farm I just plant the saplings and then bow mill them all and as you can see I'm burning a lot of them I actually um, have some wolves I don't know where they are but I really do not like the wolves they are just too complicated because as you can see they're not there anymore because I have to keep feeding them and that just annoys me. This big structure right here is not actually my house, but it is my egg farm. So, whoops, I'm in 
creative. I wasn't creative because I was just looking through the area and seeing what I could find. Um, so that's why it's like that. I'm usually not in creative because I don't like to cheat like that. But I have a bunch of eggs and as you can see there's still more. I have a bunch of shears because um, of these. I just, I don't know what to do with them but I found them and I kind of traced them back here and now they're just there. I don't even know what to do with them but they're there. Bunch of sheep, bunch of pigs. This is my first farm, my sugar cane, my wheat, and a little bit more sugar cane over here. This is my lava tower. It took a really long time to make this. What I did was I I stacked up some dirt and then I put like a little I put a secondary tower next to me and then I put lava at the top of it and then I just jumped to the second one and then I dug down. And that's how I made this. As you can see there's a bunch of trees. What I did was I just planted jungle saplings, put some dirt on top of it and then repeated the process. Um, just so I can make a big tower. I didn't this was before I made this, but jungle biome is like right over there, so I didn't really know what to do with them. Nether portal just out in the open because I don't know what else to do with it. I've been there but I don't really do anything with it. Going inside my house there is some chest over here. Pretty much just my storage room. I haven't dug out one yet. Furnaces, crafting table. Um here's where I will keep my weapons. I'm using a lot of arrows, so I just made I just put them in here. Usually I'll just use weapons. But I use as you can see I have um a lot of diamonds and that is because I have a lava source really close to my house so I just dug up I just collected some iron made some buckets and then just made some obsidian and then all I did was I just made if you don't know the video is really popular now I don't know if it's been fixed but it's a duplication glitch for diamonds so I just did that and I got a bunch of diamonds and right over here is my downstairs um, torches right here. As you can see in this world it's a lot neater because I had more of a plan this time. There's all my wolves. I don't, they always seem to stare all in one direction but you know it's kind of weird. And that one I just like to have them up there. And this one same thing except it's only two and the back is kind of different. The back has sand and there's a lot of dirt everywhere and um here's my chest I don't have that much so I'm just right there I mean I just have it right here and I got I was really lucky I um found a bunch of dogs and I put them in a pan and started breeding them and then I went on what I call a killing spree and I just took them all with me and I just went out and killed stuff and th that's how I got those potatoes and carrots and a bunch of iron which I pretty much just use for normal things I don't have any use for major things right now because it's not really important right now but yeah so this is the end of the video um, I will be trying to make more videos soon but um, like I said I don't really have any ideas for them I am gonna um, try and do a type of series to where I just go and show you how to build like basic things and more advanced things but that is still a project in the making so if you like this video like comment share subscribe and I'll make more videos soon bye